hello everyone this is asmr if today welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorial today i'll show you how to edit the outdoor portrait and i just got this picture from the jia uh, uddan yesterday that's why just i'm showing you how to edit that one okay at first i'm going to open uh, at then press the open image I'll show you how to edit this type of photo. I use the extra light setup 8600 and the trigger. That's why the light is smooth. Okay. At first make copy by pressing Ctrl J and J. After copying these two layer, just turn off the previous layer, the top layer and give here the D D for dodge turning off and here B B for burn and make the blending mode in a skin just right press go to the blending options and slide the slider find out the highlighted area of the face press the alter button and just slide this one adjust with the face okay and hit the ok button make it mask and go to the image and apply image and hit the ok button burn theory i just applied i find out the highlighted area of this image and then i'm turning on the d button d layer actually and <laughs> making it multiply same process go to the blending options and in this case slide this slider and find out the shadow area and press the alter button and hold it and press over here and it slide this slider and adjust the light and hit the ok button after that mask this one go to the image and apply image and in this case tick the invert options and hit the ok button and select of this two layer make it group and mask it and go to the image and apply image again and uncheck the invert option and hit ok you'll get the soft light the shadow in the face that's why I applied the dodge burn option. All the photographers and designer use this dodge burn like uh, this one. Okay. Now I make a copy of the background layer by pressing Ctrl J and select the two layers and make it group and make it merge. After making it merge, go to the filter and camera raw filter. After going to camera raw filter, I'll de highlight the shard. You know. The shard is highlighted how could i do that press the alter button and hold it and just de-highlight this one when the dot gone blue dot gone okay okay and blacks press the alter button and hold it uh, you are watching some dots okay okay that's good and then the white when the dot is gone fully gone then just make it okay hit the okay and uh, increase the brightness a little bit from the camera calibration i'll change the primary blue color and primary green color like that I'll make it like this one and the hue a little bit and then HSL and reduce the orange color increase the orange luminance and just I'll decrease the saturation of green and decrease the luminance of green after that I will add some vignette vignetting little bit and hit the ok button you get the change before and after before one was like that and the after one like that ok after that just go to the adjustment layer go to the color lookup options and add the horror blue color in this case I think the <laughs> Fujifilm one is good this one is good and uh, reduce the opacity a little bit 60 or 50 percent is good enough good 
make copy of this two layer and make it merge after merging this one go to the filter and the nick collection color effects pro 4 i'll give you the download link of nick collection you'll get it free and just you can apply on your image this one is a plugin of photoshop any kind of version but i'll suggest you to use these photoshop plugins in a creative cloud version okay here is some amazing filters i'm using the cross processing cross processing filters and here is the other filters and you can use any kind of filter from here okay i'm selecting this one and hit okay it will take time to load and save your image after that you'll get your output okay that's good and make it group make it merge after that i will just add some sharpness in the face i'm going to the filter and camera raw filter again and zooming in i'm going to the detail option add some amount of sharpening and add some luminance of noise reducer and the color little bit okay in this case i'll just de highlight the shirt and you are watching the face is uh, like uh, reddish that's why i'll change the hue of the orange color little bit and here is a blue color you can just increase the luminance a little bit uh, 10 is good and saturation a little bit okay and de highlight the shirt okay give some clarity and hit the ok button you'll get the change over of this okay it's uh, more sober to look at okay after that you can add some filter one filter a little bit one filter go to the adjustment layer and the photo filter add some filter from the okay that's good and reduce the feel of this one okay i'm eating, making it margin group and merge and let's see what was our previous image this one was our, our previous image and now present one thank you so much thanks for watching my video tutorial if you want to get me any kind of tutorial like this you have to subscribe my channel and share my video with your friends uh, till the next video i'm asmr signing out and bye bye